Hi everybody, welcome to my channel Healthy Lifestyle A to C. This is Letty Smith. I will be sharing delicious, easy, healthy and fast recipes. I've been making them for myself and I want to share them with you. They're gluten free and no MSG. This is the key to a healthy, happy lifestyle. Don't forget to exercise and drink water. I will be sharing new recipes every Friday and I invite you to like, subscribe and share with your friends and family. Stay tuned. Today's recipe, quinoa chia gluten free bread. For those of you that are gluten intolerant or are looking to avoid grains, this is a great recipe. And the best part is that homemade, so you're in charge of the ingredients. It can be organic and also good quality olive oil. I let it cool down and then I cut it, I put it into silicone bags and straight to the freezer and every time I want to eat one I just take it out. So get all your ingredients together and this is the list. One and three quarters of a cup of quinoa seeds soaked in water overnight and stored in the refrigerator. One quarter of a cup of chia seeds soaked in half cup water overnight in the refrigerator. Half cup water, half teaspoon aluminum free baking powder, half teaspoon Himalayan salt, half lemon juice, and one quarter of a cup of olive oil. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna wash very well and drain your quinoa. And then you're gonna remove all excess water. I like using my food processor to make my quinoa chia bread. Add the quinoa seeds, add the chia seeds and the consistency is kind of like a jello thing, kind of weird. Add salt, then you're going to add your baking powder, then you're going to squeeze half lemon, you're going to add water. Add olive oil and blend it for about three minutes approximately. This is how it looks like. And then you're going to grease your loaf tin and bake it for one and a half hours at 350. Make sure to check it because each oven is different. And enjoy. I had some chia jam from last time and so I ate it with my chia jam. Next recipe is gonna be vegetarian mushroom meatballs. So don't forget to subscribe, like, and share with your family and friends. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Stay tuned.